Hey everyone, happy new year, hope you're doing well. Today I'm gonna to be doing curl formers on my hair. The only thing I've done is prepped my hair with the Honey Hair Mask by Thank God It's Natural. Um, I just left it on for an hour under a shower cap and then washed it out with some warm water then cool water to close the cuticle. Um, and then that was it. I put it in two French braids and have just been wearing it under my turban today. I am now about to start the process of the curl formers. Um, and so I'll come back in a second, show you the materials that I'll be using and explain a little bit about the process. So the plan changed a little bit. I went from having my hair in the two braids and having it stretched to then the next, I ran out of time. So I wound up wearing a puff. And so I used my Aunt Jackie's and I just put a little of the buttercream and some of the don't drink gel. <clears throat> and I wore it in a puff, so this was, it's still pretty stretched, kind of, but I am going to um, use the curl formers, so this is what they look like, and I have the orange and the pink, hopefully they won't be too long, um, I'm gonna use, well actually I'm gonna detangle the section with the not on my watch, then I'm going to use this Eden Body Works natural pudding souffle um and it's supposed to like moisturize and have shine and then also um you can style with it and then i'm going to use i want a little bit of hold for the curls so then i'm going to use the don't shrink this is the tool and so basically you just take a section of the hair you twist it and you put this on there or i'm sorry you thread the curl formal on there and then twist it on there pull it up I'll show you guys as I get towards the end. There's tons and tons of videos of YouTube on it. That's how I learned how to do it. Um, but I'll show you as I get towards a further section in the top. So here are the curl formers, um, the styling kit. And here is the natural pudding souffle that I used, as well as the don't shrink gel. And I've really been liking that lately. Here is me just trying to show you guys how I was putting them in. I was having some difficulty. It's like I would get them, but it was such a weird angle. And then like trying to flip them um, on the little uh, twist, I guess, at the root. Um, sometimes it would get caught in there. And then I at least twice had um, the whole thing stuck in my hair and I was like yelling for my husband like oh my gosh help me that stuck in my hair um so it was like super awkward and then I think because my hair um isn't so long so it was hard like having to pull the curl former all the way down but as you see I got it um and so I was able to get it together um just showing you the process again. So I've already put the product on my hair um, for the, oh no, maybe that was the last section. So putting the product on um, and then I, yeah, it's weird like having to like use both hands to do it. So you twist it, you put the little hook right at the root, push everything all the way down and then you pull it on out. Yeah, and I did wind up sleeping in these things, and it was so uncomfortable. All right, so I'm all done. I tried to use, I had some smaller ones, but these are so hard to open. They had, I had two, a couple of small ones, the green and the blue. These were really, really hard. So I wound up going, I only got like one in there, and I went back to the um, pink and the orange because it was just too much. So... This is how it is. I'm excited to see how it turns out. I hope and pray that it will dry by the morning. I hear they're not really comfortable to sleep in, but it was a long day and I wanted to try to get them done. Um, so hopefully the six to seven hours they'll be able to sit in there. Um, I didn't do it on soaking wet hair. I just um, pretty much dampened it with the not on my watch detangling. So. It wasn't like soaking wet, so I'm hoping that it should dry relatively quickly. And um, the souffle and the gel were not super, super heavy products. Um, so once I am taking them out in the morning, I will come back and show you how it looks. 
So as I feared, my hair did not dry all the way. So my curls were pretty loose. They didn't um, get as much definition as I was hoping. And this one in the front was driving me bananas. Like there's always that one curl that just does not want to act right. Um, this is how the curls turned out. I wound up pinning them up with bobby pins and um, just kind of trying to make like a little faux hawk almost, but just did a little style. They came out okay. Um, I didn't love them, but I didn't hate them. And I actually got a lot of compliments on them. So yeah, won't complain. Not bad for a first try. So thanks for watching. Let me know if you tried this style and please feel free to like and subscribe.